Hello, and thanks for watching. Today I'm going to do something a little different. I recently came across an audio lecture from historian and journalist Jerry Reynolds. I really enjoy reading his articles. They've inspired a number of my videos. So with permission from the Los Angeles Valley College Historical Museum, I thought that it'd be fun to add videos to one of the lectures that he gave to the Valley College Historical Association meeting about the history of Santa Clarita in 1979. Here's a small portion of that lecture. This is a nice Sunday picnic uh, out at uh, Lion Station. And uh, there are three gentlemen there, in fact, several, that uh, loom rather large in the oil industry. Uh, Henry Clay Wiley, we had mentioned, and Sanford Lyon uh, had been mentioned, and also another fellow named William Work Jenkins, who had a horse ranch up at Cass Steak. Well, Jenkins and Wiley and Lyon uh, heard about oil seepages back up in a place called Pico Canyon. So they got a fellow named Lopez to lead them up there, and by George, there was oil seepages there. Uh, General Andreas Pico had been skimming the tar from the area and using it down in his uh, ranch in San Fernando. So they skimmed or spring pole a well 30 feet deep, brought in the first gusher in California, and packed all the stuff out in leather sacks. This was in January of 1869 and it was sold generally over in the Ventura area. Well, they drilled as, well, this is a replica of it, uh, is now called CSO for California Star Works, number four. Of course, uh, Lyons and the uh, Jenkins and the others were bought out uh, by the California Star Oil Works, and these in turn were bought out by the Standard Oil Company. We must all genuflect when we say that these days. But uh, Standard still owns that well, and it's still producing 30 barrels a day for them. In time, uh, a community grew up in the canyon, uh, first called Pico Springs, but in uh, 1876, a gentleman came out from uh, Pennsylvania and proved the drilling methods. His name was uh, uh, Mentry, Charles Alexander Mentry, so the name of the town changed to Mentryville, and parts of old Mentryville still exist out in Pico Canyon, and it can be visited also. Very interesting. The first oil refinery in California was first built at Lyon Station. It went out of business, so they moved the stills over to Newhall. And uh, it is, well, it could still be in operation, but it isn't at the present time. It's now a historic uh, landmark and is visited by a number of tourists. But uh, there was interesting because there was oil not only pouring down Pico, but Wiley Canyon, Placerita. Placerita Canyon had a very unusual oil. It was crystal clear. You could read a newspaper through it. That's the way it came up out of the ground. It was called white oil. Well, there you go. I sure hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. Special thanks to the Los Angeles Valley College Historical Museum for allowing me to use the audio of Mr. Jerry Reynolds. Thanks for watching. Take care.